told you Kevin would be out of bed before 10. I think he was actually awake by 9, but we kind of were just laying there. Well, your cat woke me up at 7.30. You're her, you're her feeding machine. Uh-huh. Yeah. So, guess what, everybody? What, everybody? I got a uh, new phone! <laughs> but Kevin is having the breakfast of champions. Turn that way. off. I'm recording. Mm. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> You're doing a good job, dear. Kevin is having the breakfast of champions. Rice Krispie Treats. I tried to get her to make me breakfast in bed, but she wouldn't do it. I <laughs> did not. You wanted me to get up and make you coffee, but you wouldn't make a deal with me, so I wasn't going to do it. You can make deals. Everything costs me. That's right. So, this is our last little bit of time with Carnunas. We're on our way over to the vet's office right now. He's not looking too happy. I'm not happy. I hate doing this. He's very uncomfortable. I, I don't think he can open his mouth anymore. Yeah. So. That's... You can see, you know, that, that bump right there, that orange, yellowish lump. That's cancer. And... He's probably we... lived longer than he uh, normally would have if he was in the wild or anything. Yeah. We did go, to, we did take the option to have the tumor removed once. Yeah, we did have it removed once, and the doctor did say if it comes back, you know, then with his age and everything, that it was pretty much, you know, a done deal at that point. And uh, he, as you can see, he's real, real thin now at this point. He. I don't even think he can get drinks anymore. He's really. He, I find him sitting in the uh, the bowl of water because I don't think he can open his mouth to drink. Yeah. What do you want, dear? Corn beef. I don't have to. I can get an omelet, but if I get an omelet, I'm gonna get bacon in it. I don't. Which which hurts you more? There's a lot of salt. In in the hash, in the corned beef. Corned beef. All right, well then I'll do the omelet. The bacon, I mean, there's not, it's not a whole thing of bacon, so it just has bacon in it, so I think you can live through that. Okay. Are you sure? It's your stomach. You know what's going to hurt you. you. Usually decide, whatever Kevin says I'll do and I can blame it on him. <laughs> I just, I love my corn beef. Yeah, I know you do. But... We haven't been here in so long. And I don't see Lee. I said. So, baby, what'd you get? Uh, some dead pig. <laughs> some spuds. Some spuds. Some eggs. Eggs. What'd you get? I got an omelet with some pig. <laughs> uh, mushrooms, avocados, cheese, spuds, sourdough toast. And we are at my favorite little cafe, Betty Faye's. Chop. Gonna eat now. Are you in the screen? Yes, I'm in the screen. Hi, baby. Hey, sweetie. We're at Target. 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 Kevin's got a $25 gift card. Yep. And I'm gonna spend it. Of course you are. <laughs> I wouldn't be me if I didn't. That's right. <laughs> Hello, Kevin. Yeah. My name is Monkey Bones. Okay. This is the way we have to shop now. Whee! 
least you're doing some work. Hey, stop, stop. How much, oh, he's nine, $20. It's cheaper to build a snowman. Yeah. Can, will you build a snowman? No. I'm talking to our subscribers. Oh, okay. And they're building a snowman. That's nice. Jack built some. I have. We have to put them up tonight. Cool. Yes. So this is what she does all day long. I don't do it all day long. It's a quick wardrobe change. Yeah, I see. Make sure my hair looks good. Look, honey, I have bells in my ears and bells on my antlers. That's not just your brain rattling around? No. All right. Now I can really drive you even more crazy. <laughs> I didn't know it was possible. Do you want to build a snowman? No. I'll have to ship you back east if you want to build a snowman. <laughs> Isn't it cute? Yes, dear. You can't have it. It's like for an eight-year-old. How small that is. So you got your nice ride in here? Yeah, I even got a horn. Wow. But it says it says no children in the basket. But does that mean I can't get into it? You're not a child. All right. Well, I'll climb in. So okay. Go ahead. <laughs> so Val decided Boomer needed a new toy, so we got this thing, it's supposed to run around. Let's see what happens with the Boomster. <laughs> Boomer, I think it's winning. <laughs> So here's Bootsy and what she thinks of the new toy. It's like, stay over there. <laughs> and I'll stay over here. Yeah, she's 14 years old. <laughs> she's she's not the playing type anymore. <laughs> and Boomer's gonna go back to his box. Just like a little kid. You buy them a toy and they wanna play with the box. Oh, it's gonna go play in a sandbox now. <laughs> I don't think you want to film that. <laughs> All right, go. Hey guys, I am oovooing right now with Dana B. Saw. She is thumbs up, excellent vlogger. Go check out her channel and subscribe. Here she is to say hello to you guys. Hi guys, how's it going? It's me. Just talking about for like the first time. And yeah, stuff like that. I can't say. So yes, uh, now I have to put a cord on the car. But <laughs> but yes, I'm I'm Team Kevin, by the way. Yay! Kevin. Check me out. I do a lot of tags. She does. She did. She just tag us. She tagged us in the 99 random questions, but she only did how many? Did you do? I think I did like half of them. She did like half of them. That's a lot. Yes. Let's say goodbye to, bye to our subscribers. Bye, guys. We'll talk to you a little later. So, what are you doing? Nothing. What's in your mouth? My tongue. <laughs> Not wrong. So, Kevin is cutting up the dead pig. Yep. How's it look? Looks good. Tastes good too. Yeah, I thought that's what you had in your mouth. And we got loaded mashed potatoes. Pre made because I was lazy today. We did too much running around today. Actually, it's all Kevin's fault. One more store. One more store. Yeah. We need to go here. That we need to like do me. this. Yeah, that sounds like me. <laughs> Bon Appetit! As you guys all know, we are avid animal lovers. And most of our subscribers are animal lovers as well. And Jess Lucero is 
one of them. He is driving 150 miles to go to, I believe, a football game. And one of his friends has a bat, not a baseball bat, but a real life bat. And it was ill and needed to be gone, sent to a sanctuary where they can heal him and raise him and take care of him properly. And it is close to where Jess Lucero is going for his football game. And he's driving 150 miles to go to this game. And he is taking the bat with him. And he is dropping him off at the sanctuary. So Jess Lucero is driving 150 miles with a real live bat in his car. And you guys will see a picture right now. Hey, everybody. Guess what time it is. I don't know what time it is. It was time to retire my cat ears and get some antlers. And they jingle. Yeah, I know when she's coming. And not only do they jingle, I got earrings that jingle too. So I make just enough jingling noise to drive someone a little crazy. Er. You, don't, you don't look crazy going like this all the time. <laughs> Master Yoda! He said I hit his OCD nerve when I kept saying, I got a new phone! Yeah. You know, I had to edit a few of those out. It was really annoying. Yeah. So, I'm sorry, Master Yoda, but to make it up to you, we're gonna put you on the credit roll. Spaghetti roll. No, not spaghetti. He's got food on his mind. Christy Schreier, Shriver or Schreier, welcome to the neighborhood. Your team Megan. Yay! Munch Ginter. Ginter, also known as Nikki. Sorry we missed you, but welcome. To the neighborhood, Logan Rice. Welcome to the neighborhood, Chloe Elizabeth. Welcome to the neighborhood, Unedited Life 01. She is still trying to hit 50 subs. 50 subs. And Get this, if she hits 50 subs, she's going to put 50 sour warheads in her mouth at one time and hold all 50 of them in her mouth for one minute. And she hates sour stuff. And boy, I could see some drooling right now. Tanya Ray. Thank you for being Team Val, and she says I, that was not nice, but she says I should keep driving him nuts, like I did with the phone last night. I got a new phone. I got a new phone. Now I could do, all night long. Oh, and these two are for you. You read that one already. These two? These two. Oh, Katie Caroline wants a shout out for me. Hey, you're not even Team Kevin, but I'll give you a shout out. Shout out to you, Katie Caroline, and Lord Jake is also Team Kevin. I think we need to get him a shirt of him doing this. And it says, Team Kevin, yeah! That, that hurt my throat. Okay, so now for some sad news. Um, you fart? <laughs> my phone is making noises. I still haven't set all my new settings yet. Sarah Nadine Evans, her father is ill and is in the hospital, so if everyone could please keep him and her and their entire family in your thoughts and prayers, we would greatly appreciate that. Thank you, Sarah. Hugs. Antonia Fanare um, sent me some information. They have 15-foot snowdrifts. It's the rec 
they made the record for the most snowfall in 24 hours. Grocery stores are empty. Roofs are collapsing. Um, the, the worst one was the nursing home where the elderly were and they had to be rescued. Um, now they're expecting rain. So you figure 15 foot snow drifts and rain, they're expecting a lot of flooding. So, but we got an announcement to make. I'm pregnant. <laughs> gonna say that I swear I didn't know <laughs> that's that movie Arnold Schwarzenegger wasn't he pregnant in a movie yes <laughs> I don't remember what it was called no we have an announcement to make we are going to be having a ugly sweater Christmas party so we want all of you to wear your ugliest Christmas sweater and send us your pictures and we are going to pick a winner, and it will be announced on December 15th, and this is the prize. It is a wax warmer with four different wax melts. So, if you want to win this, start sending us your pictures of you in your ugliest Christmas sweater that you can find. Ow! Can I get my arm out first? Okay. It is time for... You say it. What? What is it time for? It is time for... Uh, community credit, no, neighbor. neighborhood community credit roll. That's right. Yay! You want to say the next thing too? No. He does not ever want to say this thing. I don't know why. No. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you. We would not be here if it weren't for you all. We love you. <laughs> Thank you. Like, we love you. I can't see, do that. See? Doesn't that look like a heart? Yes, dear. We love you. Can you see the heart? <laughs> we love you. Thank you. Thumbs up. And we will see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. I've got her new phone. <laughs>